Hey, so I just wanted to talk about this chart real quick if I don't get a chance to hear from you on its learning. But essentially, inside this chart are all percentages. I don't want to like highlight everything, but inside here are percentages. Outside are z-scores. So these bolded numbers, those are your z-scores. You have the ones digit, the tenths digit, and then it goes to the hundredths. So you always start going up or down and then you go to the right. So for example, like 0.82 is right here. So that's 0.82. But the reason I wanted to show you this chart and talk about it real quick is because you said you're having trouble with those particular questions. So this chart always gives you the percent, whew, trying to write. This chart always gives you the percent to the left. So when you look here and you see 78814, that is the percent to the left. So when it says to find like the lowest 70th percent, 70th percent. So the lowest 70% means that 70% of your data is to the left and 30% of your data is to the right. So what you're gonna do is you look for the number inside that yellow box for the number closest to 0 0.70 without going over it. So as I'm going through, I'm just trying to find, like I, I see these two numbers here, and this guy right here is the closest to 0.70 without going over. So from there, what you wanna do is you find the z-score that goes with that percentage. So my z-score that goes with that 0.69847, that z-score is 0 0.5, 0 0.5 all the way over to two. So those questions are just asking you to find the z-score that is correlating with those percentages. If it says to find like the upper 10th, uh, upper 10%, you just have to always remember that this, this chart in particular always gives you the lower percent. So if it says the upper 10, then what you're looking for is the number that's closest to 90% without going over it. Okay, I hope that helps. Let me know if you still have some questions.